Hybrid Bike vs. Mountain Bike At a glance, it's apparent that hybrids have similarities to both mountain and road bikes. So I wasn't sure if a hybrid would be different enough for my mountain bike to be worthwhile. So, let's get started. Number 1. Frame One of the most obvious visual differences between a hybrid and mountain bike is the frame. When it comes to the frame, hybrid bikes have a frame that is much closer to a road bike than a mountain bike. Because they aren't expected to take on extreme conditions like those found in mountain biking, the frame is both slimmer and lighter. Number 2. Suspension Occasionally you may come across some hybrid bikes that have a basic front suspension to make them a bit more trailworthy. However, it's usually not up to the standard of a true mountain bike suspension. Hybrid suspensions are usually of lower quality and have far less travel to keep weight and added cost at a minimum. Number 3. Brakes. This is ideal for many hybrid riders because they will be using the bike for short commutes or casual riding. Since most of their rides are relatively flat, the added power of disc brakes is usually unnecessary. Since weight is less of a concern for mountain bike they always default to using disc brakes. Number 4. Gearing. Mountain bikes are expected to take on a wide variety of conditions on the trail. From easy flats, steep downhills, to extreme climbs, there's a lot to work with. For this reason, mountain bike gearing usually has a wide range to help a rider through these different scenarios. By comparison, hybrids are more likely to spend time on flat-ish roads with occasional hills, so they won't need as wide of a range to help the rider. Number 5. Tires. Mountain bikes come with big burly tires full of knobs to provide the ultimate traction on the trail whether it's dry, wet, and anything in between. However, when it comes to road riding, these big tires can slow you down. Those knobs and extra width create more friction and slow you down on paved roads. For this reason, hybrid bikes come with thinner smooth tires. Number 6. Fenders and Cargo Racks Because they are often used as commuters, many hybrid bikes come with fenders and or cargo racks. While neither is a requirement for hybrids, they do make a lot of sense. If you're commuting to work then you certainly don't want dirt and water to fling up from the bike onto your work clothing. Number 7. Handlebars. While most hybrids and mountain bikes use flat or riser handlebars there are occasionally differences. The primary differences between a hybrid and mountain bike are that a hybrid bike has a more lightweight and aerodynamic frame, thinner smooth tires, use rim instead of disc brakes, and generally do not have suspension. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe our channel.